put a bunch of teenagers on a TV set and what do you get? A whole lot of footage for a blooper reel. The cast of Stranger Things had loads of fun, fails, and jokes on set. Let's have a look to see the best behind the scenes moments from the series. The premiere episode of the series included a kiss between actors Joe Keery and Natalia Dyer. On screen smooches can be awkward, but the young actors didn't hesitate when it came to fooling around and making a joke of the scene. We knew they were talented actors, and now we can add sock puppetry to the list. No, I'm kidding. Why do you think I want a nice and quiet? The famous snowball scene near the end of season two definitely had the young actors nervous, as for a lot of them, they were going to experience their first kiss over and over and over again. Let's be honest, kissing can be awkward as it is. At a camera crew, parents, and being a teenage actor, awkward through the roof. To add to the occasion, Mike whispered, I'm coming in to 11 before the kiss. But he was like, okay, I'm coming in. And I was like, <laughs> yeah. and I was like, no, you didn't. We can even see the subtle movement of his lips in this scene. We sure hope someone told Finn that that's not the best choice if he wants to keep getting smooches. Sadie Sink and Millie Bobby Brown seem to have endless energy, considering they perform full-blown musical numbers between takes. It's Gayton always singing all the time. It's Gayton, Millie, and Sadie. The sweet friendship between the two comes across in this video, and it's just the best. Maybe the reason Bobby Brown had a double take correcting herself saying Anna is because she was filled with excitement to entertain her BFF. Anna, shit! Anna, please go back home! Not only is this super fun, but it shows off just how talented these young actors are. Deep, 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 slow. Oh, we're not done with the singing. We're just getting started. You miss me by my taco. You're gonna miss me when I'm gone. Remember this creepy scene in the third ep of season three? Turns out, behind the scenes, it was quite the elaborate production. My name's Ketchup and my name is Mustard! Yet again, these ladies show off their killer musical and comedic skills. It's definitely a good way to make these spooky scenes easier to film. Is there a million Sadie CD coming out soon? We're pretty sure we'll be buying it. Talented and thoughtful? Here is another reason we love Millie Bobby Brown. Mwah. While no animals were harmed in the making of season three, a dummy did suffer some minor injuries. Fortunately, Bobby Brown is a thoughtful scene partner. Hopefully that dummy didn't have too many takes left. Sorry. While a lot of the line flubs come from the young actors on set, the adults have their fair share of mistakes. We can only imagine how wild that set is, so it must be tricky to stay concentrated. Who knew Grandma could be so funny? With so many takes, we're not even sure who to blame for the endless laughter. It's your grandma. What? It's your grandma. <laughs> no, it's your grandma. Obviously, there are pros, though, since they finally nailed that scene. It's your grandma. After a whole lot of bloopers, that is. Naturally, actors will sometimes mess up their lines a bit, but sometimes the flubs are so big, they change the whole meaning. Last time we checked, Dungeons & Dragons isn't exactly known for being full of girls, but stranger things have happened. Today is a new day, a day full of girls. Today is a new day, a day free of girls. Maybe it was a Freudian slip? Nice try, Will. Speaking of Dungeons & Dragons, the jargon can definitely be pretty tricky, so it's no surprise it took actor Finn Wolford a while to get those lines. All right then, I'll use my torch. I'll use my torch to- <laughs> Looks like the multiple takes got the best of Caleb McLaughlin as well. I just wish, I just, I just wish. Although with this bunch of jokers, it's really not a surprise. If there was only one shot of each scene, the show probably wouldn't look as good as it does. But it certainly would be a barrel of laughs. I mean, how many times have you been able to pull an axe out of a log on the first try? Thank goodness they kept all the bloopers for us to enjoy now. When waiting on set, some actors read books, some scroll through Insta, but when it comes to the cast of Stranger Things, their downtime is a bit more elaborate. When we say the cast is musically talented, we mean it. And their range is huge. 
from TikTok creations while on set to full-blown rap songs and musical numbers on talk shows, it's never a dull moment with this crew. Okay, my name is Eleven, I'm 24-7, I mean, I go waffles by the pound. Are they available for hire? This scene seemed to be pretty slick. A suave exit from a field of grass? Could it be cuter? Well, the reality is, it wasn't always so graceful. While Mike made a swoon, he wasn't always the knight in shining armor when Eleven took that tumble. Were there any Millie Bobby Browns injured during the making of the show? From the looks of this, probably. While violence isn't funny, the cast definitely had a lot of laughs, especially when it came to slaps. Not to worry though, they weren't real. Although it is impressive to see how realistic they look. How do they even come up with this stuff? Maybe there's an action film in their futures? When filming, it takes a lot of planning to get everything just right for the perfect shot. Inevitably, there are often tech and prop malfunctions, leading to take after take after take, which can leave the actors with a whole lot of blooper content. We're looking forward to a whole season of bloopers. Anyone else? Let's be real. Trick calling someone has been around longer than most of the Stranger Things cast members. However, it seems like Millie Bobby Brown isn't just talented beyond her years, but pretty skilled at a classic talent, the gag call. Like, yeah, she goes, <laughs> is this Dusty Buns? She definitely gave fellow cast member Gaten Matarazzo quite a scare. Hey Haley, Millie's landing in a minute. <laughs> We wonder how her PA felt about those joke calls while she was doing Godzilla. Boredom is bound to come about when the actors are on set for hours on end. But obviously, it was never a dull moment for this cast and crew. Who knew a boring old escalator could be so much fun? Looks like none of them could resist this bit of adventure. Maybe the electric slide should be their next musical venture? For whatever reason, the boys of Stranger Things find themselves getting stuck pretty often. Name something to get stuck in, and they probably have. A vent? Check. A bathroom? Check. Stuck in this bathroom and the door is heavy? In a chair? Check. We're stuck on their show, so maybe that's their secret? This may not have been on set, but considering the show was set in the 80s, it makes sense that the cast, most of whom weren't even alive back then, should learn about the stuff that was around in that era. They definitely had some fun checking out the goods and trying to figure out what the stuff was or how it was actually meant to be used. Whether or not they knew much about the 80s before filming, they definitely made the era cool again. What? It's known that the cast is full of jokers, so anyone around may be prone to getting fooled. Since so many actors on set are kids, this includes parents. Having lots of realistic props definitely helps pull off a freaky trick. Great for the ones pulling the stunt, not so much for Noah Schnapps' mom. We're glad she took the creepy joke so well. Stab this tiny little X where the smoke is. <laughs> yeah. Gaten Matarazzo is such a lovable goofball and pulled so many tricks that it warranted his own pranking show. This is not a joke. Fans can check out the Netflix show Prank Encounters for all the Matarazzo shenanigans. I know what's happening. You're on my prank show, Prank Encounters. We know what we'll be binging next. We can only imagine how much fun it would be to hang out on the Stranger Things set. The balance between spooky scripts and lots of jokes around behind the scenes is probably a reason why the show is so popular. Yeah. Which blooper was your favorite? Do you think you would have a hard time keeping a straight face on this set? Let us know what you think in the comments section. <laughs> it's so cool. Don't forget to like and subscribe to keep up with us here at The Things.